Alcatraz versus the Shattered Lens is the fourth book in the Alcatraz Smedry series by Brandon Sanderson, and like its predecessors, it features a mix of humor, adventure, and unique magical elements. The story further delves into the battle between the freedom-loving free kingdoms and the dark, controlling forces of the Hushlands, which are the lands controlled by the evil librarians. The book's protagonist, Alcatraz Smedri, is a teenager blessed or cursed with a unique talent for breaking things. He is a member of the Smedri family, each of whom possesses a distinct magical talent that often seems more like a funny curse than a typical magical ability. Alcatraz, his cousin Bastille, who is part of the knightly order that protects the Smedris, and their family find themselves in the midst of an escalating conflict between the free kingdoms and the librarians. In the Shattered Lens, Alcatraz and his friends find themselves on a mission to save the city of Mokia from the advancing forces of the librarians. Mokia, one of the free kingdoms, is a strategic point crucial in maintaining balance and preventing the librarians from gaining control over important territories. As the librarians lay siege to Mokia, Alcatraz learns that it might be up to him to turn the tide of the war. One central element of the plot is the revelation of the Smedri talents that prove both wacky and incredibly useful. Alcatraz's ability to break things, combined with his friends' and family members' talents, such as arriving late to appointments or tripping and falling with style, are all woven into the narrative as key to overcoming obstacles and enemies. The siege of Mokia is intense, and the protagonists are met with various challenges. They need to deal with the siege, the aggressive tactics of the librarians, and the political intrigues within the free kingdoms. Alcatraz, Bastille, and their companions work together, utilizing their talents and wits to resolve difficult situations and overcome the odds. The magical lenses of the Hushlanders are another focal point in the book. These lenses grant their users different magical abilities when looked through. Alcatraz comes across the shattered lens, which holds immense power and the potential to end the war. The Smedras believe that if they can utilize the lens, they could gain a significant advantage against the librarians. However, the lens is broken, and fixing it requires a unique understanding of its magic and the way its pieces fit together. As the plot unfolds, Alcatraz also grapples with personal issues, including his sense of worth and destiny. He learns more about his estranged parents and the complex history between the Smedri family and the librarians. He wrestles with the question of whether his talent is a gift or a curse, and what his role in the broader conflict truly is. Throughout the book, Alcatraz's first-person narration is filled with his trademark self-deprecating humor and direct address to the reader. He often breaks the fourth wall, discussing the nature of storytelling and his own reliability, or lack thereof, as a narrator. Characters develop significantly over the course of the story. Alcatraz matures as he confronts the responsibilities thrust upon him. Bastille faces her own trials, particularly regarding her duties as a knight and her relationship with Alcatraz. We see growth in their companionship, as well as the growth of the entire group, as they face trials that test the limits of their talents and tenacity. In the climactic finale, Alcatraz and his allies confront the librarian forces in an intense battle. With determination and creativity, they manage to utilize the Smedri talents in ways that give them an advantage despite the overwhelming odds. As they work to repair the shattered lens, Alcatraz discovers new depths to his talent, which enables him to see the potential in broken things, perhaps even to fix that which seems unfixable. Their efforts contribute to turning the tide in the siege, leading to a dramatically charged conclusion where Alcatraz and his friends manage to avert disaster for Mokia, though at great personal cost. Alcatraz's role in the fight against the librarians has far-reaching consequences, and his journey sets the stage for future conflicts and the further development of his character. Throughout the story, Sanderson continues to explore themes of power, responsibility, and identity. The characters must decide what it means to be a hero and how to use their unique abilities to help others, even when it might be easier to focus solely on their own safety. By the end of Alcatraz vs. The Shattered Lens, the characters and the readers are left with a deeper understanding of the magical world Sanderson has created, 
as well as the personal battles each character faces. The dramatic adaptation of this book brings an extra dimension to the story, potentially featuring voice actors, sound effects, and musical scores to enhance the atmosphere. The book concludes leaving readers anticipating the next installment, eager to follow Alcatraz and his companions as they continue to fight for the free kingdoms and uncover the deeper mysteries surrounding the librarians, the Smedri family, and Alcatraz's destiny as a potential savior or destroyer of this fantastical world. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.